One of the things that's going to happen as we do more remote virtual work is that our cell phone voicemail boxes will get full. And then people who are calling us are going to hear this. The person you are calling has a voicemail box that is full and you cannot leave a message. That's not going to be conducive to us being able to create business opportunities and grow our business and engage with our clients. So I want to share with you that those of you who are using a iPhone, you need to manage your voicemail box. Let me show you what I'm talking about. If I go to phone and then if I go over here to voicemail, you can see I only have a few voicemails because I've deleted all the ones that I want to delete. But as, as I delete them, sl slide to the left and hit delete, slide to the left and hit delete, okay, you'll th they go away. Well, they don't really go away. They go out of this home page. Where they go is to deleted messages. And there they are. Okay, so you'll see those voicemails there, and in order to get them to go completely away and stop taking up space in your voicemail inbox, you have to hit clear all and to clear them out and get rid of them. Now, I'm back to my voicemail home box. Another thing to pay attention to is that if you're blocking a phone number, you're gonna. They they may leave you a voicemail, and they will be they will be in what's referred to as blocked messages. And I don't have any right now, but you need to pay attention to that subfolder as well because you need to purge those out as well. There is nothing worse than trying to do business and getting a full inbox so someone cannot leave you a voicemail. So manage your inbox so this doesn't happen to you.